Hello, come in! Are you there? Mr. Fairy is a Dragon Roost Cavern, is he not? <laughs> Thank you, Tingle. You make my day. Hey! <laughs> oh no, he's here. Hey guys and gals, I'm Pal. <laughs> We're Pal? No. I'm Pal. You're Pal. And this is Nova Momicon, the Slayer of books. And this is Wind Waker. Go through the door and go to where we last left off because this is not where we left off. This is an alien place. Last time, we entered Dragon Roost Cavern, which was a place which with enemies, and we walked on air. Me and Link. Link, Tingle, Tinkle. Their group name. If you didn't see it, you should go back and watch it because our... Oh, wait. Meh. Our walk through the sky was pretty impressive. Oh, this is one of the secrets. What? The, this place reeks of treasure. Tingle bomb time. Oh. We might get rich with a 10 ruby bomb. I think that voice works for him. Go hey, ahead. You, you got your blast shield up? Yes, I do. Boosh! So this is one of the many things that Tingle can do. I love that we're still explaining the intricacies of Tingle this far in. Few though they are. Yeah, very <laughs> few. Tingle doesn't even really. Are you kidding me? 10 rupees. We spent 10 rupees to get 10 rupees. Tingle! <laughs> Here it comes! That's what he says. Uh. Thank you, Tingle. You are a gentleman and a scholar. Nova's in control, by the way, this episode, because that's how it works. And I think everyone is rather satisfied with how these episodes are working. We're getting through the game rather quickly. I love how we each have different play styles, and... Tingle's working out better than I thought it would. <laughs> As I proceed to loot and maraud oh, the, the room. Oh, thing. I think, but really, I think this let's play is working out rather well. We're ten episodes in now. No, yes. I don't know. I don't know how many episodes we are in, in right now. But we're in there. What are you doing? You're missing. Should I just take care of this? <laughs> no. Don't spend my money. That's my money now. It's your money. So in my episodes, it's my money. And in your episodes, it's your money? Yes. But Whoever is controlling Link, it's their what money. What if I told you it's Tingle's money each time? <laughs> so it's kind of Tingle's money each time. So Nova's just going around here finding out all of the enemies. Hey! Sorry. I didn't realize he was in- Oh, Red Rupee! Red Rupee! Paper bombs! <laughs> That's all I care about. But yeah, this Let's Play is working out rather well. And Wind Waker is a fantastic game. The fact that we could get immersed in the game that quickly without having to explain a ton of things or be really uh, unused to the game is is impressive. It just throws you right in there and it's a game that is like riding bike. Once you learn, you never not learn. <laughs> if the term you're searching for is forget, you never Maybe. forget. I'm also controlling Tingle, so there's obviously something wrong with my mind. So we're getting Wait, are you saying there was wrong something wrong with my mind last episode? No, I'm saying saying Tingle rubs off on you. Oh. On everyone. Tingle is love, but he's not life. Yeah. No. And he ends up making you as greedy for rupees as he is. Mr. Fairy, don't climb on the table with your shoes on. Oh my. Young people these days have no manners. That's another thing. Tingle is one of the long he is one of the longest living members of the Zelda franchise. <laughs> I mean, he was his first game Joy was pendant. Majora's Mask, in which he had a balloon head. He was 35 years old in that game. Really? Yeah. Did they say that? Yes, specifically said he was 35 years old in that Ooh. game. And this is Mr. Fairy. There's something written on this wall too. What? Don't kill him yet. Don't kill him yet. Water in this dreadful heat. My body soaks it up like a sponge. Of course, it has been fouled by bokoblins, just like that room. Uh, only utter dehydration could make this water taste so fair, but it does. This water has given me the strength I need. I mu I will get out. I must. How I long to be with my people just once more. I'm failing at this. What is it? What is the sign? Wait, what? Mr. Why Fairy, Tingle can't read anymore because you're drowning in lava. Link didn't jump for some reason. So this is a magtail, and in their current form, they are near impenetrable. But once you use water on them, they're actually more impenetrable, as they'll take, like, seven hits there to kill them, which is interesting. Um, so, magtails are just killed by 
soaking them in water and killing them, or they're killed in a single parry attack, which Nova failed to show off. Well, you can't do that on this small platform. There's no room. They would push you off. True. And now we're going to ride this lava geyser up. There's so many things in, in Wind Waker that Wind Waker is like the first thing to do them. I think that's one of them. Hmm. I can't think of any other Zelda game that that would be a thing. Okay, let's go Here's ahead. Here's a spot where we could use Tingle Balloon. Bomb this. Mr. Fairy, if you thought... No, Rupee. He's, he's a... Uh. Got it. He wouldn't let me bomb it, but he would let me bomb the area right next to it. Thank you, Tingle. I can, I can get the other one, too. You better... Mr. Fairy, if you thought rupees could buy your happiness, then you're an idiot. No, he won't let me do this one, so you're going to have to do it. Yeah, Tingle's finicky in this dungeon. I think it's just because it's the first dungeon. Stupid man. Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. I need to explain the fog pots. Oh, yeah. Fog pots function very similar to the Okami counterpart of the same name. Fog pots will take you to another fog pot in the dungeon. Last episode we encountered one, but I didn't point it out at the we end of last two. episode. We encountered two? Yeah. Oh, okay. So we encountered... Yeah, we did encounter two. There, in every dungeon, there's one at the beginning, one around the middle, and one towards the end. Yeah, so we could do that just to warp around the dungeon. It's, it's good in case you leave the dungeon and have to come back. Um, another thing is that I could actually get you to the boss right now. Wait. We don't have a key. Without the key. If you use a glitch called storage, where if you fall off one of those ledges up there and activate your Wind Waker three frames before you land on the the ground, you'll activate storage, which essentially allows certain points, certain things that should happen to happen at a later time. And mm. so what you can do is activate storage, save it, open the chest, and it won't actually trigger the drop. Instead, you can instead run through all the walls, run up the wall, and go right into the boss room. It's actually pretty cool. All but right, now we're ready? up here. Here we go. Savor this area, though, because once you're here, you'll never be able to leave. It's sad. You mean you'll never be able to get back. Yeah, you'll never be able to get back. And I can help you in this area. Uh, but I can't lock onto the enemies, which is weird. But that's fine. Did I blow them up? Did uh -huh. I do it? Did I help? Yes, Am I helping? Did. Awesome. I'm going to blow them up now. Nice. That's awesome. It's like interactive co-op experience. Look at that. You, you kill this one. You got it. You're, you're my buddy. Can I blow up medley? Someone is, is here with a heart, he says. Tingle, you're a weird man. All right, Mr. Lippy Man. Don't give me lip. <laughs> man, nice. I, I love Tingle. We're spending a ton of rupees. You always fall for that. Uh, but now I should explain fighting moblins because we've never fought them before. They have a lot of powerful attacks. In fact, once they lose their weapon, they will unleash a powerful attack right now, which you always fall for. No, I don't. And <laughs> there's also a lot of comedy in them. If you manage to hit them in the backside, they'll do that. And that will happen. Awesome. It's Mr. Fairy, I prepared Ting for you. You can heal if you want. Good old Ting. But you did it with coactional experience. Link, you came to rescue me. Oh, thank you. I have to tell you what I found out. This is terrible. Some creature is doing awful things to the great Valu's tail. That's why he's so angry. The great Valu's tail hangs down into the room right below here. There's got to be something in there. I wonder if those mean monsters who captured me have something to do with it. We've got to do something, now, before it's too late. I'll go and tell everyone what's happening. Here, Link, use this to get out of here. It's what I used to get this far. It's a device we, Rito, used before we evolved wings. You got the thing! We got the grappling hook! This was an item used by the Rito people before they had wings! <laughs> also, we're saying Rito again instead of Rito. Yeah, yeah whatever. Ugh, habit. You can use it, even use things to use it up to haul things from the seafloor while boat on the floor. Here, Link. Climb up on that little ledge over there so I can show you something. First, get the treasure. Also, she has wings now. Yeah. Y you noticed that, right? Uh huh. She didn't. She wasn't able to fly. I'd never noticed this before. She wasn't able to fly before she got up here, and now she's able to, because she got the scale from Valu. 
she glided when we threw her. Yeah, she wasn't able to get up there before, and yet now she's able to get there just fine. Mm. She got a scale. I just got that. That's awesome. Go, no, no, go open the pot. Open the pots. Pots, pots. We're, we've used rupees, so you, you need pots. You are so greedy when you pot. play Tangle. Pots. Sweet pots. Well, I'm not greedy. I just used a ton of money while I was helping you. I blew up dudes. It'll actually be interesting for me to look at that in post later, because I was watching the Game Boy screen. Grab this branch with a grappling hook, and you can swing over here to get out of this area. When you aim at a branch that you can latch onto, the symbol will appear. Remember that. Don't you worry about me, Link. Get going. Wait, wait, wait. Take a moment to look at Valu. That's Valu. Well, could you back up a little bit? I want to get a good view of him. Look how big he is. Like, from from a distance, he doesn't look huge, but he's he's pretty he's pretty decent. Okay, you can I leave. I still can't help but question his design, though. Yeah, his wings are tiny, and they look like fairy wings. No spoilers, but if if you ever see his wings in action, it would look ridiculous. Tempted to blow you up again, but you know what? All the Don't delicious. you dare. Or I will get my revenge when da, I play da, 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 da. I am Indiana Jones with a sword. I am Indiana Link, and we could have used the tingle, used the tingle balloon to get past this area. You know what? We probably could have gotten through this entire dungeon without getting the grappling hook. Maybe. Well... Mr. Fairy, let just let me say one thing. Getting the grappling hook means you are getting close to that darling girl medley. What? What? You lucky duck. You can't hide your feelings from me. Tingle is so weird. <laughs> Bless his heart. Uh, Tingle, <laughs> please stop. You're too awesome for us. <laughs> That's one way of putting it. But yeah, now we have the grappling hook. I'm really interested to see if we could have gotten past this area without doing stuff. Oops. I could blow him up, but I'm not that mean. Okay, he fell in the lava. Good job. There's a guy in there. Three, two, one. Kill him. Kill him with fire. I really need to be paying attention to the tingle map, because if I don't, then I'm going to be missing treasure orb. Can I blow him up? Oh, he's dead. Yeah, we got the thing. You're, you're going fast. I am. Oh, no, no, the thing. The I see it, I see it. I think it's because you're not commentating like I am. Well, yeah, and speed is my goal. Is it your middle name? No. Oh, okay. Thought I'd ask. What? That, that doesn't make sense. By killing Bokoblins to get Joy Pendants, we get a Joy Pendant? Do they, were they just short on the, the chest quota? They're holding our hand at this point in the game, trying to make sure we get enough of those for later. I guess. Of course, Tingle's going to ha have something stupid to say about this thing. Yes, he does. Mr. Fairy, let me see a <gasps> Kulu Limpa no! of your own. What did you do? It didn't cut the third rope. Ha! 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 Sorry, I, I had to do that because you you laughed at me whenever I fell. Now it's my turn to laugh at you. Oh, oh my goodness. Cut it out. Did I do it? I did it! Tingle was telling me to use a Kulu Limpa on it, so I did. Sorry, it was Tingle, not me. Also, this is something that no no other Wind Waker Let's Play has. What? Tingle. Co-optional Tingle Gaming. How the many future. other Let's Plays have you watched? Not many, but I've... I've glimpsed enough. The future is now. We can have Tingle killing us. No, the future would be now if we showed Tingle on screen. Oh, man. If only, if, if only, if only we could have done that. And if only the Wii U version had it, this feature. I like how I'm just going through this automatically. I'm, t right? I'm in autopilot right now. Yeah, and I have nothing to say about it because I am Tingle. Well, I mean, I have, I, I could say something, but Tingle can't because Tingle's Go away. Tingle. Just go through the door. Why do you bother fighting them? Because he's annoying. I could use Tingle Balloon. Now, we could use Tingle Balloon here, but this is actually what we were supposed to... The grappling hook is what we were supposed to use to get that, that thing earlier. 
but this area is one of the cool things and also the reason why we got Tingle in this co-optional adventure. Once again, we're still explaining this this man even Hurry this far up, in. Pal. In every dungeon of the game, with the uh, exception of few, completely voiding my statement, there is an area where we could blow up to get a super secret chest. And if I examine it, he says, try using your Tingle bomb here. And so, uh, no, 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 you will die here. There, get against the wall. Up against the wall, and no one will get hurt. Ready? We just got a chesty chest, and a this big, is a big, one? a big chest. Wait, wait. Do you see? Do you see your hat? Yeah. Inside the chest is a collectible. Da ba da ba da. Ba. You got the dragon tingle statue. It bubbles over with warmth. It will be waiting for you on Tingle Island. <laughs> Oh, Link, you found it! Why, this, the Tingle Dragon statue. This is the Tingle Dragon statue. My younger brother Knuckle made it for me. I'm in what's called the Courage Stance. By the way, there are four left. Please look for them on other Icelands. I just imagine that Tingle pronounces everything poorly. He calls Ice Isles Icelands. He calls Hopping, Hoping. And he calls Grappling Hook. Not be, not using the Tingle Balloon. <laughs> Whereas you could use the tingle balloon. Man, it's it's kind of hard for me to sit back and watch someone do this because I'm so used to explaining everything that's going on. Uh, don't use the parry attack on this because it w won't work. Yeah. So these magtails, you could just hit him, but okay. Hit him. I, I f let me He's just say, just, let me just say, I like the the um, the attack animations for these guys. They're just they're just cool enemies. They're not in any other Zelda title. They're just, but they're neat. Why did they not explore fire Wait, men? Wait, they weren't in Skyward Sword? No, they're in no other Zelda title oh. at all. But they're no, cool. wait, were they in Minish Cap? You know, they might have been in Minish yeah, Cap. Yeah, I, th I think they were. We got a big key, not the boss key. We got the big key. And also look at the front of that key. Vady confirmed. Vady confirmed. Okay, go ahead and skip past I'm, this. I'm sorry, Vady is my favorite Zelda villain. You're welcome for introducing you to Minish Cap. And now, here's an interesting thing. Now all of the, the keys have turned into fire keys. Did he really? Why? All, all of them are now fire keys because we got the big key. It doesn't really impede our journey any. They still hurt just like they did. But it's interesting. Why did they do that? I don't know. I think they wanted to explain the significance to you. <laughs> he told me of the prophecy. That the future hero would be significant. Flashback. Are you reading? It will be significant. Are you reading from Tingle right now or making this up? Um, it's from Kung Pao Enter the Fist. Oh. One of the funniest videos I've ever watched. Despite the beginning, it is actually worth your time. The beginning is what grabs you. If anyone doesn't know what I'm talking about, go go and watch. What did you do? Okay, you're good. Kung Pao Enter the Fist. It's it's so I ridiculous. Can make it. You can't even. Drat. It's so ridiculous you can't even believe it, and yet it's so ridiculous that you have to share it with everyone you know. It's just that good. I'm trapped in this room. Tinkle is trapped. <laughs> Mr. Fairy, if you go out into this lava, you will be safe. You can take his advice. Link was having a spaz attack. Link, Tinkle didn't actually say that. I was just hoping that you would be gullible enough to do that. So now we're going to the boss door already. Just kill them. Don't try and don't try and go past them. They take one, they're a one-hit kill. Just do it. Make so first it's don't kill the bat, go through the door. Then it's kill the bats, don't try to run past them. I mean if they're Make in your up way. Your mind. If they're in your way, kill them. Just throw the pot. Wait. No, you don't have to wait, it just did the thing. Huh. Goodness. If you wait too long it will sink. It takes like ten minutes for it to sink. What are you doing, Bakoblin? Everything Goodbye. is falling apart. What has oh, science wrong. done? You're gonna fall off. Should I blow him up? No. Um, How did I get myself in this in trouble. situation? Get get out, please. I went the wrong way. Ha! You died, son. You failed to blow up the bridge. I, I blew up the bridge. No, you didn't. Oh, okay. Well, we're all we're already through this dungeon, really? Are we seriously already through the dungeon? We've seen the boss door, so. That that's where we're going. How 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 has this happened? 
two episodes. You're welcome. Hey, I got I got really far. I got really far in my episode, I'll have you know. If you don't make it to the halfway point of the mini boss, you didn't get well, anywhere. Well, th here's the thing. The, the mini boss isn't the halfway point in this. It's like three quarters of the way through the dungeon. By the time you're there, you've already been in every room but two. So technically, it's it's like the three quarters point, 80%. You only did 20% this episode, Nova. Disappointed in you. <laughs> Would have thought you'd done better. Goodness. Yeah, well, I'm going to do better right here where you no, failed I'm gonna earlier. I'm going to kick you out of this Let's Play. You can't. Why? Because... Hey, you want to try storage? No, I don't. I kind of want to try storage. <laughs> Go ahead and kill him, and we'll try. And I will try storage once. Or twice. Why did you not kill him? That should have killed him. The he's stairs. dead. He's, he's dead now. He's He has no cares. Okay, so you can Hold open on. the right chest. It's fine if you do that. And there's a fairy here, because there's always a fairy there. In every Zelda game. Okay, go ahead and get the the, the right chest, and then we'll go ahead and get the left this chest one? with storage. Yeah, get that one. It doesn't matter which one, I just want to show this one off first. Yeah, we got a Knight's Crest! Keep it in your spoils bag. This is the thing that we saw Orca in possession of. And now Nova is handing off the controls to me temporarily. She has Tingle, and, and I'm going to try storage once. Tingle's taking a break right I've now. I've never done storage, ever. But it's it's a perfect place to try. Okay. Um, I believe if I do this. No, no, no. No. Frame perfect, man. Frame perfect. No, no. Okay. Oh, I did it! I did it! I did it! I did it! I have storage! Okay, now, I'm pretty sure this is- I'm doing it. Okay, now, what you do is, as long as you don't press B here, you will exit out of- you will have storage. So if I just change the wind, I don't have to press B to exit out of this. I'm pretty sure I got it. If I did, I'm, I'm really excited. Okay, there's no wind for me to conduct. Okay, so I don't have to press B here. And now, I just go up to the chest, open it. Did I do it? No, I didn't. If it worked correctly, what would have happened is I would have been able to... I wouldn't have gotten anything. Um, nothing would have happened. It would just open. The animation would have played and nothing would have happened. And then I would have been able to run up here, run up the wall, go through it, and go to the map transition. So I didn't do it. Oh well. Hand tingle back. Oh. And now well. the controls are back in my hands and Nova is going to do the boss already. You can't use Tingle in the boss fight, so... Yeah. Fairy must fight the boss all alone. Oh, and how Tingle wanted to fight by Mr. Fairy's side. Too I'm bad. Too bad. To... No. Yeah, you don't need anything. Well, you need your I'm going to do that so I don't accidentally use the fairy. Good idea. Now, I guess I could explain what fairies do, but pretty much everyone um, knows. I'll explain, any knows I'll explain anyway. I'll explain anyway. They restore your health, and if you die with one in your possession, they will bring you back to life and restore your health. It's basically an extra life. There you go. Creepy. And now, the first boss of the game. But no one's here, so we're good. This is Goma, the first boss of many Zelda titles, and it's gotten a, a substantial facelift in this game. Normally it's just a, a really weird spider that does stuff and can be killed in like 8 seconds, but in this one, it's awesome looking, and the music is great. This is probably one of my favorite bosses in the game, and you just took damage. And unfortunately Tingle's not able to do anything here. So, in this boss battle we do what we would naturally come on, come on, come on. do. Oh, you didn't do it. Are you going to say that every time? Yes. What we do in this boss battle is we dodge his attacks and wait for him to get stuck in the ground. When that happens, we quickly no, grappling no, hook. No, no, no. You are taking damage. Pal, be quiet. We grappling hook up to Valu's tail, and as Nova would show it off. No. Man, he's he's fast. He's on top of it. He's not really getting stuck in the ground. Try running the other way. Oh, he's stuck! He's stuck! No, he's not. Oh. Oh, man. Try running the other way. Oh, look 
that he broke it for me. Okay. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Got it. You got it. See, running the other way was the answer. And now we're pulling on Valu's tail to do goodness knows what. Also, he's sitting on lava. So now that we're doing this, <laughs> we're <laughs> we're easy pickings for to him to die. Once again, that was English. And we bring the weird crackly thing down and on his head. Awesome. And then he will raise the roof back up. He He's literally the raising the roof. But the thing that Nova did here is awesome. Now she got an easy cheat to beat the boss. What she can do is just keep repelling off of Vilu's tail and rinse and repeat. And you land back on these platforms where it's much harder for him to swipe you. Although he will blow fire on you if you stand there too long. Which will light the platform on fire and knock you off. But he can't hit you. Which makes this boss fight almost too easy. It's really sad. Get there, but... Okay, are you ready to get his tail? Mm -hmm. Thanks, Velu. We wouldn't... What would we do without you? Seriously, what would we have done? I think it's him? the other way around. What would he do without us? What What would we do though if his tail wasn't there? It's really kind of sad that this boss is this easy, because it's awesome looking. And there it is, boss done. Well, sort of. Man, he's ugly. So now that he's broken our only means of killing him, which he should have done in the first place. It's our turn to finish him off, I guess. Oh, come on. You, you can kill the men in Black Monster. He's not that hard. Just kill the cockroach and be done. Kill her. Or him. Or it. I don't know. It doesn't really matter. You're gonna fall in the lava. Now, if you do fall in the lava here, it'll just bounce you right back and you'll take some damage. So, it's not like a map transition or anything. But it's, it's really kind of sad. Like that. <laughs> But one thing that I do like is that is how reminiscent this boss is with the Ocarina of Time um, Goma. If if you compare the two side by side, it's it's amazingly similar. But also in skill level, they're both around the at the same point. I bet this looks epic in HD. It does. The I, lava. I've seen some stuff in this. I'm really specific, by the way. I've seen some stuff in this. And he's dead. That's it. Link almost got crushed by a giant eyeball. And we got the first heart piece. Heart container. Yes, that. And we can take the magical journey right back out. It's kind, it's kind of sad, honestly. We got... This was like three episodes in, and now we're, we're done. We're just flying through stuff. But maybe uh, we should discuss the whole boss arrangement that we came up with. Yes. Um, that was one thing I wanted to talk about. As for the bosses, I think it wouldn't be fair if, by coincidence, one of us got to do all of the bosses. Like, say we get to the next dungeon, and by coinky dink, it's Nova's, tr Nova's episode again to do the boss. And that's just not fair. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be alternating on the bosses. I'll do the next one. Nova will do the one after that. And so on. Which and so works forth. out perfectly because the next boss is his favorite in the game. Yeah, it, it works out. And then the boss after that is my favorite. Finally, Velu can use the bathroom. That was his toilet. It was. What else was it? It was the throne. I know, I'm ruining it. Yeah, you are. <laughs> hey, the chest is back! It is? Yeah! You see it? No. It panned down, and it's right there. See it? Behind Link's head. Oh, but it's empty. But still, it's back up there. So some voodoo witch doctor threw it up there. Well, Prince Kamali, don't you have something you want to say? Oh boy, him again. Um, I heard everything from Medley. Link, thank you so much. I'm sorry I mistrusted you. I hope I hope I can be like you someday, Link. You will, Kamali. I just know it. Right, Link? A jawbreaker? So, Link, here. 
I want you to take this, Link. Giving you the thing I value most will give me the courage I need to stand up to bad things. I got the jawbreaker! You got Din's Pearl. Din, my best friend. This is the gem the Ritos claim was passed down from the great goddess. You know why I'm her best friend? Why? Because I'm her pal. I'm a pal of Din. Wow. The great... Oh. The great Valu is grateful to you, Link. Redundant much? Scoobly, scoobly, boom, 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 That's his voice. Use the wind god's wind? That's what he said, but I don't understand. I wonder what it means. The wind god's wind. I wonder if what he's talking about has anything to do with the wind shrine that's through that tunnel. Oh, uh, we've, we've been there and done that. Oh, I almost forgot. The Great Valu also names you, Link, a true hero. I agree with him. As far as we're concerned, Link, you really are a hero. Well, I'm going to go visit Bel Valu. Get my scaleness. I'll come and visit and see you sometime with the best pair of wings ever. Hey, Prince Kamali. Thanks so much, Link. See you again someday. So is she like his babysitter? Mm. Or do they just use the term attendant? Yeah, I think she's an attendant. Okay, see if there's mail in there and then we'll end off the episode. No, there's not mail. Well, we'll investigate stuff. Next time, go through that pool to get rupees, cause I need I need money. I need the casino monies. Man, we we completed the thing so quickly. Like I'm, it's it's just blowing my mind how Lightning quickly we passed. got th through that. Typically, I like to spend my spend a lot of time in there, but we just flew through it. Man. All right, I won't dwell on it too much longer. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed this episode in any capacity, please click like. And if you didn't enjoy it, drop a comment telling me I could make the next episode so that you would like it. <laughs> you're, you're leaving me with low hearts. You know that, right? Oh, well. You'll uh. deal with it. And we release new episodes of Wind Waker Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. And we'll see you guys next time for another Pals Play Wind Waker, where we will do one thing near that w wind god's shrine thing we'll go do something over there that has opened up because tingle can do stuff and tingle's awesome so we'll see you guys later